Hello, my name is Leopold Armesto and in this presentation I will introduce you how to use infrared received instructions with Facilino. So, this is the outline of the presentation. First I will present you the material that we will use for this presentation, then I will explain the worked instructions and at the end of the presentation I will explain you three particular examples for receiving infrared codes for uh, playing sounds with, uh, uh, based on the infrared code that we receive, so it emulates a piano. And then in the third example, what we're going to, see, to do is to light the uh, color LED, so depending on the button we press, we can re receive and execute different kind of commands. So this is the material that we will use for this presentation. As usual, we are using the Wemos D1 R32 together with the Arduino multi-sensor shield. In particular, we are going to focus on using the infrared receiver which is connected to pin D6 and also we are going to use an infrared remote controller as you can see here. So, these are the work instructions. The first instruction, it will execute whatever code we put inside here to do when we receive an infrared code. So, uh, these instructions is, uh, is based on uh, infrared remote uh, library on Arduino, so it works for many kind of manufacturer uh, uh, infrared remote controllers, so if it detects that your uh, controller is sending a valid code, then it will execute whatever code, as I said, inside here. This second instruction is expected to be used always inside uh, this available instruction, otherwise, otherwise it will return you the last read code. So, this uh, it's useful whenever we want to see which codes correspond to each pattern. And the last instruction it's useful whenever we want to generate a set of commands and execute different actions based on the code. So it's a mutable instruction so we can add multiple, multiple commands and set the infrared code for each of the commands and execute the corresponding instructions. In addition to this, in this presentation I'm going to use the advanced buzzer instruction to generate uh, frequencies uh, or tones with different frequencies and also I'm going to use the RGB LED instruction to set the color of the LED. So in this first example, as you can see here, I'm printing the code I'm receiving from the infrared, so whenever there's a code available, I will be able to use this instruction here. And this example is useful to see which co codes correspond to uh, each of the buttons of your controller. In this second example, what I'm doing is uh, whenever we press uh, the buttons for changing the, the channel uh, on, my, on the infrared uh, remote controller, we will receive uh, the, the numbers 0, 1, 2 and 3 and so. So I'm using this as a distance to reproduce a tone based on this initial uh, frequency, so this is the base frequency and depending on the number I press here, or the code I receive here, sorry, I will reproduce a different sound. And then in this last example, what I'm going to see, uh, what I'm going to show you is how to set the color of an RGB LED based on the received infrared code. So I have created, as you can see here, four cases. The one corresponds to the typical button to power off the TV. So this is the number 12 and then this corresponds to the, the channel 1, 2 and 3. So depending on the code I'm receiving, I'm executing a different task. In particular here, what I'm doing is I'm just simply setting the color of the LED. So in this presentation I have show you, shown you how to use infrared receive instructions with Facilino. Thank you very much and I hope to see you on my next presentation.